I, I was looking into your Twitter account today because it, it's your Twitter account, right? And I, there was a lot of good stuff there. And you uh, had a, you had a motto, I think, saying, "Do no harm, take no shit." Yes. Did you get any good advice in your career that you remember that you've taken with you? Yes. How can I remember it though? How can I remember it? Um, I know I've had good advice from everybody. I knew somebody told me that I would never really do well until I got older. Which was true, because I was never a great beauty, and I knew I was a character actress, and so it took a lot of years of patience and working on my craft to be ready for my my shot. And your Oscar. Mm -hmm. Do you remember that day and getting up on stage and receiving that? Yes, and I wish I could do it all over again. I didn't thank my mother properly. I didn't thank my husband, who was in the audience at that time. We're no longer married. I'm not sure that was it, <laughs> but... You know, I, I wish I could have thanked my parents because they gave up a great deal to put me in that position. Okay. You make people cry, you make them laugh, and you scare people a lot, I think. What is most enjoyable for you as an actor? For uh, I like to scare the poop out of people. I love to do that. I, although, last year on American Horror Story, sometimes I even made myself sick. <laughs> but I love to make people laugh. I love to make, I guess I like to do the whole thing. I love to people make people laugh. I love to make them cry. I love to scare the crap out of them. I love all of it. I feel so lucky to be able to do what I love to do. Because I know so many people who don't have that opportunity, who are just as talented as I am. Do you get scared watching these horror movies? Do I what? Do you get scared yourself watching horror movies? Oh, God, yes. Okay. <laughs> Sometimes I have to turn it off because I'm by myself and I say, okay, I can't watch this right now. I have to wait until it's daylight or, or whatever. I'll go check all the doors or, you know, that kind of stuff. Sure. I love to watch horror movies, though. God. I love you to watch You scared me so much in Misery. I was like, I, I still <laughs> I have that, that's so like, clear in mind, that film. Yeah, I know. It's oh. been, yeah. Great. So you've been in this industry for so many years. What keeps the sparkle? How do you stay um, excited about doing new projects? That's a very good question. Um, I went through a tough time a couple of years ago. I had my television show canceled. I was diagnosed with breast cancer and had a double mastectomy. And I went through quite a few months of feeling like everything was over. And um, and then I started getting work again. And even though I grumble about having to pack my bags and leave home and go stay on location and, and be by myself sometimes, um, I'm really better when I'm working. And, then I don't, and I still don't know if I can make it to 70 or 80 or 90 and still love to be in this business because the business has changed. You know, the page has turned. Things are very different now. Thank you so much. I think Thank my time you. is up. It was amazing. Blah, blah, yeah. blah. But it's so interesting to talk to someone like you, you <laughs> nice know. Nice to meet you.